Welcome back. We are in the PTL kitchen with our friend Doug Heilman, content creator and chef for Doug Cooking. And we're kicking off a summer series of recipes, each focusing on one key ingredient. Yeah, and today's key ingredient is honey, but not just any honey, right, Doug? That's right. It is gold quality European organic honey from Bulgaria. Cool. And I have some okay. for you guys to taste right there. I can't right. wait. I love honey. Yeah, I think honey is such a unique ingredient. Uh, depending on where the bees are getting the Ooh. pollen and the nectar from, you might not just pick up sweetness, but you might pick up floral and or herbaceous notes. And Ooh. yeah, it's really delicious. That is yeah. deeply flavored. Like you can taste, like it's so sweet, but it's, I could eat this whole bowl. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it's it's actually unlike any honey that I've had before. Right. And when you talk about floral, mm -hmm. you immediately get that. Yeah. Yeah. Right. It's really good. Ooh, I, wait, I, I think about it simple. like just having different, <laughs> like having different oils or salts in your pantry, having a few different honeys because you get that different flavor profile, and you know it goes great in drinks or salad dressings. Mm. Of course, we drizzle it over, you know, some granola. But today we're going to do a breaded cauliflower, and we're going to glaze it in the honey. Okay. And the nice thing about that too is we're not really cooking the honey, so we're preserving serving more of its sort of natural yeah. flavors. Gotcha, so, okay. So down here, let's talk a little bit about our cauliflower first. So a cauliflower can be kind of a tricky vegetable for some folks, and uh, a couple tips that I've learned along the way is, uh, in order to not make a mess around the kitchen, I mm -hmm. actually turned it upside down and we cut the core out. So we're working from underneath to actually get the whole core out, and eventually it starts to fall apart. And then David, I'll just show you one more trick. Uh, when we start getting those pieces that we want to take towards more of a bite size, right. take the tip of your knife and then just sort of turn it. And like twist it. Yeah, just yeah. twist it. And then so you'll start getting those more bite sized pieces without having like some really ridiculous flat side. Oh, look at side. that. It, it actually works. Right it works. It never works for me it as well works. as it works for you. That was good. Yeah, it works. <laughs> and what do you have here? This is a nice batter that yeah, we're going to add. So, yeah, so we've done a few cauliflowers already, um, just bite sized florets. And then we have to kind of have something to stick in that uh, in that crevices and all the nooks and crannies. Yeah. So I have an egg and mayonnaise mixture. So we've just mixed that up and we put that over our cauliflower. You know, once you've got uh, a whole head uh, sort of caught up uh, into your bowl. And you know what, if you didn't want to do a whole recipe, if you wanted to do a half recipe, this would be great in the air fryer in the Ooh, summertime. Oh, good idea okay. too, People so you don't have to turn the oven on. Them. Right, yeah. right. So we're gonna give that a toss and uh, make sure that your cauliflower florets are really nicely you know, soaked through. And then I have a breadcrumb mixture here. And yeah, I've done a few already. This is a combination of both panko and regular breadcrumbs. Again, it gets into all the nooks and crannies. And then we're gonna pop it in the oven, 425 Fahrenheit for about 25 minutes, and it comes out nice and crispy. Yeah, so maybe don't do it on a 90 degree day. But yeah. air fryer. Air fryer's a good thing. That's, no, that's a good, a really that's when good it comes chef. into that's play. Right. And you know what? And this looks good already. Yeah. But you're, right. you, you have big plans for this. Right, that's right. Flour. So let's turn our attention back to our honey. And if you guys okay. will uh, indulge me, I'm gonna have you make a honey glaze in this. Uh, bowl here. So, so we have this honey. Yeah, so we have a third of a cup of our uh, delicious honey. And a pro tip, I oiled my measuring cup so that as Heather takes it out, it's going to come out a little bit more oh, easily. Oh, yeah, look at oh, that. So you don't leave any of the honey behind. You don't leave any of, don't waste any of that honey. Mm. Don't no. waste any of it. So delicious. And Heather, if you also want to go ahead and add, there's a little bit of lemon juice and lemon zest. We have some spices there, which okay. is uh, turmeric and ginger, a little chili flake and salt. And if you want to give that a stir up, I'm going to get some of our baked cauliflower out of the oven. I really love that we're doing this series too, because oftentimes when you think of these single ingredients, you want to make them the star, but sometimes it's hard it's to hard. incorporate and think of these recipes. Right. This is great. Well, this looks right. great. So now I'm going to toss these in and- uh, Just right in this bowl. Yeah, I'm going to do it right in the bowl and then we'll give it a big toss. And so I'm going to- uh, I want to get out of your way. Yeah. I know you got a hot <laughs> to give Doug some Yeah, yeah. We're, we're just going to get them all in. These have been, again, in the oven for about uh, 25 minutes. They get nice and crispy. Oh, yeah. Look we're look just going to get them all in there. They're still really hot. And we want to give them a toss quickly so they don't steam and lose too much. Yeah, you don't want to lose the crispiness. The crispiness. Right, yeah. right. Okay, so you I do got, that. I got you want to get them coated. Right, the exactly. Exactly. And again, this um, this gold quality uh, European organic honey from Bulgaria, so good. I mean, I would be using it on, you know, all different items yeah. throughout the summer. Can I tell you, I'm, I'm even thinking, my husband loves toast with peanut butter and honey drizzled on top. Oh my God, <laughs> absolutely <laughs> perfect. Yeah. Totally simple absolutely. and beautiful. You know? Absolutely perfect. This though, this would be impressive to serve if you had company over. And overboard. And I got him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. At the beginning. A little bit of chives over top. Look how beautiful and this is. Yeah. You guys, 
If you want to get in there with some forks. I do. Place. I don't. Oh, yeah, we you. have plates yeah. here, but I don't know. Yeah. If oh, look at this. Okay. Yeah. okay here you go. Take I think we just me. grab a fork. Right. That's yeah. what I was Let's thinking just too. It. Let's just dig in. Dig yeah. In. Let's. All right. Mm. Well, hopefully, it's not too hot. No. Oh my gosh, the honey, the lemon, accents it so much. Like it almost brings that flavor out more. This is the best cauliflower I've ever had. Yeah, it's like, unexpected, right? Really, it's really flavors. unexpected. Right. All right, thank you. Yeah, wow. All the ingredients, including the honey, really put it over the top. Oh, thank you so oh, much. Guys, thank you so much. What a fun series. Thank so you. So fun. Can't wait to do it again.